Hello and welcome everybody, back to Willy Kofan Gentleman Warfare. This is a new project and as you can see, we are playing one of the older Annos. This is Anno 1602, History Edition. Therefore, optimized to run on modern systems, though it has still, uh, still some minor issues. For example, I can't open the uh, options menu, but aside from that, I already did a little test and the game seems to work just fine. So, let's explore together what the original game was all about. This is how the entire series started. And yeah, let's go for average difficulty. And yeah. Under which flag will you sail? Of course, white. So, and... Yeah. We are going for that one here in the top right. We have a lot of building space. Those are mountains. I was thinking also about that one, but maybe we will able, uh, we'll be able to secure that one as well. We will see. So, now we can only hope that we are going to be faster than our competition. And why is there a Nordic island that far in the southern hemisphere? So, yeah, a lot of the mechanics that many people have run love about Anno uh, are not yet has been established. are not even part of the game at this I point in the it. series. So yeah, that will also be interesting. Okay, let's check. This island's resources have been determined. Tobacco and vines. That is perfect, this so I personally prefer sugarcane. We have iron. Nice. Okay, now let's check if we can get that big island and see if there are spice and uh, cacao on it. We only need spice and cacao, the rest is... Uh, the cotton is actually quite okay. So we... Um, so yeah, we have only six fertilities compared to the newer annals. As you can see here, on the bottom right we have tobacco, we have wines, we have sugarcane. And then there's also spice. Uh, cotton and uh, cacao and that's it because the game is actually a lot smaller so how are we going to build the city that is actually a very good question I mean we can reorganize everything later so maybe we should just start with a proper Supply of wood. And yeah, I also believe that the uh, that the series is going to be a bit shorter. I mean, since there's not that much content. You have in the game. come upon a foreign culture. A foreign culture. A rival has established a new settlement. Okay, let's check what this do we have island's here. This island's resources have been determined. An ore deposit has been. De we have no cacao here. Okay, then let's check that area. Where's the other AI going? I mean, there's here that volcano island that would actually be quite suitable for building a city, aside from the sometimes erupting volcano. Uh, there he is, probably going to settle on that island, right? An island yeah. has been settled. Okay, they did not really take the biggest islands that were available. layout maybe two rows and only oh, maybe upon a foreign culture. Um, yeah yeah so many foreign cultures seriously 
Okay, then I will use a layout that I actually usually don't use. But here it seems to be necessary. Okay, so what we are going to do is... I'm going to prepare three wings, well, mainly two, and then also that area here a little bit, with um, 16 houses each. Yeah, so basically two times eight, also on that side, and here we will see how much we can cram into that. And we can expand that later, actually. So, let's see. What this island's resources have been determined. An ore deposit has been discovered. Unfortunately, no spice. That's a shame. Set full sail. But I'm still going to get that island, be it for the cacao and cotton alone. So, and I'm also going to build a marketplace here, because um, just a warehouse could easily be destroyed by the AI. Two, three, four. That is, if I recall correctly, what is needed. Yep. You're also going to buy tools. Aye, aye, and now we need to find the spice island. Is that here going to be our spice island? Well, we have that other big one. Yeah, let's go. Uh, let's get the other big island. Also, get a basic food production here. And then we have three islands, and then we are set for the game. Maybe we'll also get that one. I just need to be careful, because at the beginning we are not getting that much money. And we totally don't want to go bankrupt here. And at the first population stage we can actually raise the taxes to the maximum. Oh wait, can we actually... Yeah, that would actually make way more sense if I built the city here. In that corner. should then really do the trick. Um, Ahoy! Can the forest here please grow? And I know I'm being very slow right now, but that is actually on purpose. Because choosing the island strategically it's going to open up quite many options.
So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we don't need that one. Yep, there's going to be our city. So you get now a bit closer to the coast, because we need all that wood. No, so it was the other way around. Yep. Plot a new course. This island's resources have been determined. An ore deposit has been discovered. And this island clearly is not aye, good. Aye, Captain. And as we can see, the AI is clearly more advanced than we are. But don't worry, this we are going to catch up. resources have been determined. This island has ore deposits. And this island also has a way better building space. Into the shrouds. So, and that way we now mark three islands just for us. And we are safe. Now it's time to start building the actual city. Yeah, I'm a bit sorry for the delay. So, red is the AI that started first. As we can see, they already got quite cloth production. And some people may be asking, Felix, why are you recording this? You always said that you can't monetize this game, and I'm now like, well, that's still the case, but I don't give a fuck. So yeah, this series is not going to be monetized at all. I'm just playing it because I want to. So, now slowly we are decreasing our cost, and not a moment too early actually. Yeah, time to get all of that wood, also from that island, so that we can build more houses quickly. Yeah, and apparently I forgot to send our ship. Well, we are just selling the wood here. Set full sail! Aye, aye, Captain. Someone is on. Alright, the AI wants to interact. Okay, good. Have now a trade agreement, everyone. As you can see, the AI has no characters. Which was a big addition that came with um, Anno 1701, though they tried a little bit with 1503 already. By giving the character's name. But here just red player, blue player, yellow player. Oh! And yellow already got to the second population tier. Red as well, blue as well. Okay. I might have to speed up a little bit.
so that is all the basics of our city. And really, yeah. I forgot to properly connect the fishing nut. Oh my god. See, I'm so unconcentrated at the moment. Just, why? Your city grows and thrives. It's not like I'm doing anything special right now. So the houses and uh, the gaps I'm leaving here are going to be for fire station and the doctor and so on. food. Now please give me also a bit more wood. So I can build a cloth production in this area and that here will be for alcohol and tobacco. Okay then, that is now our basic city layout. From here we will go improve them over time. for that. Here's also an interesting thing. Both farms may overlap, though that means I would not even be forced to have everything connected via road. I could just build a, um, a Viva set and the dude working there would automatically collect all the, um, all the wool from the sheep farms. But I'm still doing that with road connection because I want to have some wool in reserve. You know, just in case. for this episode will be to reach the second population class. Something that will happen rather soonish. Okay, now we are waiting for a bit more wood. city has been founded. A rival declares war on you. Okay, that never happened to me before. Really, never. Okay, now I need to be careful. We are officially at war <laughs> in the first episode wow that was even quicker than cardinal lucius in the um imperator playthrough So, the 
that shall be the first area. Yep. And here we get our first settlers. Sheesh. Why? There's so many islands. There's even a big one. Smoke pour in the alleys of fire smolders. Oh, it seems like An things island are has been settled. Oh, someone escaped the volcano island. Wise decision, Blue. Wise decision. Yeah, there's also not much more space on that island here. An island has been settled. Yeah, but settling that one is actually quite okay. So we are slowly getting into the positives. But yeah. I need to be a bit careful. Because we are very low on food. I need a bit more money. So let's just wait in a lot of painstaking process. I just had been a bit too greedy in regards of islands in the early game. But again, we will recover from that. Plot a new course. So, we are also going to sell wood to an inventory of 30. A competitor has built a new ship. So, time to build a new fishing hut. Now we also got the next one, yeah, that should stabilize our food supply. Our income is positive. At least if we are not calculating with sales, which I am never doing. So Red, you declared war on me. So you shall be removed. Into the shroud. And I think that is also going to be our thumbnail. Fire a broadside. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, this very, very, very rocky start. And we are going to stabilize over the course of the next one. I mean, now that the basics are set, that shouldn't be much of a problem. And yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, then please give... Well, really, I'm not concentrated. Maybe I should stop recording for today. But yeah, um... If you enjoyed uh, this episode, then please consider giving this episode a little thumbs up. Would be a great feedback but also really help the visibility of the channel and starting this series as a project. And yeah, if you have any feedback, questions or whatsoever, then just type it down in the comments. I will make sure to read it all. Fire a broadside. Really? That one's out of range? Okay. 
And yeah, if you want to get notified when something else is being uploaded here on the channel or the next episode of the series, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and that notifications are activated. With that, I say goodbye and see you next time. Bye bye.